Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another Walking Dead video. So in this one here, I wanted to talk about the Daryl Dixon show and just sort of titling in general, because that seems to be something that a lot of people have a hard time, you know, coming up with. Like a lot of fans have a really hard time coming up with names for Walking Dead spinoffs, because to be honest, it is really hard. Like the name Walking Dead or The Walking or The Walking Dead, you know, it really does work so well. It's such a perfect name. Like, honestly, when I think of anything with, with zombie-related content, like, The Walking Dead is just the perfect name. And it's crazy, because, like, before The Walking Dead ever came out, I would have said Night of the Living Dead made more sense. And if you ever would have came up with some sort of zombie apocalypse story, it would have had to have had, you know, dead in the title at some point. But no one really came up with The Walking Dead, really, right? Like, that wasn't necessarily a thing that people used a lot. It was just, it was just always sort of something like, you know, something of the dead. Or, or whatever, right? Because you're copying sort of George Romero's story. But The Walking Dead, it just makes so much sense. Like, it, it's it's the perfect thing to describe the zombie apocalypse story. But if you're going to do a spinoff story, you know, in terms of branding and marketing and all that, that's where things can get a little confusing. But Norman Reedus, I saw, did have an appearance somewhere, and he actually did sort of talk about the title and a title that he wants. And, and I don't necessarily know exactly what he's, he's implying by it, but I believe that everyone sort of gets what he's saying because of the of the example that he said. So anyways, before we go any further, obviously make sure to be a subscriber if you do want to get all my walking to content like this. The episode 19 is going to be airing in just a couple days from now. So I'm definitely very excited. I'm counting on the days now. Now, I see a lot of articles saying that, that The Walking Dead spinoff, you know, being titled Daryl Dixon, is basically confirmed at this point. I don't think it's confirmed at all. Like, it doesn't seem to be confirmed at all. Like, not at all. I think people are going based off of that Walking Dead Universe teaser that we got for content coming out next year. Because, it, I mean, it literally did say, like, Daryl Dixon, new series. So, obviously, you know, seeing that, you would just go with, okay, it's called uh, Daryl Dixon, right? And then you see Rick and Michonne, new series. So, obviously, you would just go with that, you know, assuming that it would just be called Rick and Michonne. But it seems like that's not necessarily the title, but... That is the title that Norman Reedus actually does want to go with. It seems like Norman Reedus wants to have the title just like The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon or, or something like that. He made an appearance, I think it was last night or the night before, but it was in the last couple of days or whatever. And he actually talked about the title for this spinoff. And he just kind of said, like, let's just think about it. You know, She-Hulk is She-Hulk. Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Batman's Batman, so why not this be, and then he says, boom, boom, but, you know, like, you know what he means, right? Like, he means Daryl Dixon, because this is Daryl Dixon, so why doesn't the show be called Daryl Dixon? And I've actually talked about this, too. I've talked about this for the last, I don't know, how, like last week, or even longer than that. At this point, just call it The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon. There's no other title that you can give it that's going to make it, you know, more recognizable. The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon, I think, is the perfect title. You could just call it Daryl Dixon. But I just think calling it The Walking Dead, Daryl Dixon, because it just sort of, it, it, it's the spinoff of The Walking Dead. You're still giving it that branding. Um, everyone knows it's Daryl's story. And also, it just relates with all the other shows that you have, right? This way, if you look at The Walking Dead universe spinoffs and just all of its shows that it's had, you know, ignoring Fear the Walking Dead or The Walking Dead, you know, there's The Walking Dead World Beyond, The Walking Dead Dead City. The Walking Dead, Daryl Dixon. I think it just works so perfectly, and it just it's it's it just works. I I really I simply like that name. I, and if you if you see that out there, just you know walking around, you see uh, an ad on the bus, the subway, or or anything like that, you're gonna recognize that it's The Walking Dead, Daryl Dixon. And I think it just works perfectly. And so Norman Reedus, it seems like that's what he's saying that he wants that the title to be that. Like he's not necessarily coming out and saying that that's what it should be called, but he is saying like She Hulk is She Hulk, Spider Man, Spider Man, Batman's Batman. So. You know, and, and I, I do agree with that title. Like, he is fighting for this to be the title, but I do think it works the best. And I hope that they do actually just do that. I think more of their concern is that if they do that, then, like, what do they call the Rick and Michonne TV show, right? Because that, that, that one there, I think, is a little more complex. Because calling it The Walking Dead Rick Grimes... I think is probably going to make them, you know, obviously the most money. It's going to be the most recognizable out there. But you do have a character like Michonne on that TV show, right? And you did announce the TV show as a Rick and Michonne TV show, right? So unless they want to go off of that, I mean, they can't really now, right? Like originally, the Rick movie was just the Rick movie, right? And we all sort of thought, well, maybe it would just be called Rick Grimes, right? Like The Walking Dead Rick Grimes or 
Grimes or, or something like that. I guess you could still use the title Grimes to sort of, you know, be a reference to Rick and Michonne. That still works. So, yeah, I think that's definitely one of the more trickier things to come up with, you know, is the title for that show there. Like, what do they do, right? Because you can call it The Walking Dead Grimes, but is that the perfect title for it? I mean, honestly, and it's it's really crazy, but I feel like the Rick and Michonne TV show like the perfect title for that is the walking dead like that's where the main characters are rick and michonne to me are are i mean obviously rick for sure is like he's the ultimate lead of the entire universe right and then you have characters like michonne and daryl and carol and maggie who are sort of like the, the second tier characters to him right obviously very very important characters i'm just saying like rick is obviously like the ultimate presence in everything here right andrew lincoln just dominates everything here with the walking dead story and that's why to me you know you're gonna have him on this show you also have a big character like michonne on the show like th this show should be called the walking dead this is essentially where the main plot is you know throughout everything like the daryl show and and dead city you know is gonna be somewhat related to the civic republic there, there there might be other stuff that they deal with but overall the main plot is going to be the connections to the civic republic and yeah and so that's why i think you know titling shows it's it's tricky, right? Like with the, with this franchise, it's definitely very very tricky because a lot of people want there to be really just like titles that sort of are out there. And I, I guess more the belief before was just that you really had to have dead in the title. Like you, if it never had dead in the title, it wasn't going to work. But clearly that that is changing now, and I, I think it's because there's very limited options if you have dead in the title. Obviously, all the dead works, but what are you going to call the the, the Daryl spinoff and the thing is, the Daryl spinoff, the reason why I also think like calling it The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon works the best is because the whole show, I really doubt, is going to be s just permanently set in France. That would be pretty crazy to have the character out there for that long. Obviously, for a full season or maybe for even a season two, I could see that being the case, but... I personally believe that if in any way they want to continue this storyline and have Daryl reunite with Rick, Daryl has to come back from France. There's no way our characters are going over there. So if he does come back over here, I mean, I could definitely see them teasing the fact that when he comes back, he ac accidentally brings that variant of Walker back over here. Like, definitely, I can see that. And so that's why I just think calling it The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon works the, the best. And I, I really do, like, personally, I, I, I would like to know what you guys think about this whole situation. Because I know people are, sometimes can, can get very heated with this debate. Because if it's a bad title, or if it's just a very generic title, then they're upset and they hate the show and they're not going to watch it. But, like, man, I, I really, to me personally, I don't think the title really matters all that much. And maybe I'm just at this point now because I've just been sort of sick and tired of dealing with you know, titles and with all these spinoffs trying to come up with names for them. It's just, it's sort of, it's tiring. I, I, I just, I, I don't know. I really think keeping the title very like simple, you know, a, a, keeping it a name where it's easily marketable to everyone. I, I think that it's, you know, it has to be recognizable. Like Isle of the Dead, like it's a cool name. I understand that the name is, is cool, but like if you're titling something Isle of the Dead, a lot of people might not notice that. Whereas if you title it The Walking Dead Dead City, and then you have, you know, images of Negan or Maggie on, on the cover, people are going to be wondering, whoa, what is that? Like, is that a, a show with those two characters? And then they'll watch it. Whereas if you title it All the Dead, you know, especially if you're, if you're searching on, like, Prime Video or something like that, and you just type in The Walking Dead, All the Dead might not come up, right? So I could see definitely in terms of, you know, using the, the name Walking Dead for branding, I think it makes the most sense, and that can also obviously apply just everywhere worldwide. That name is so marketable. I, I think it makes sense if you if you want to have more eyes on this. And again, a lot of people can have issues with with what I'm saying in terms of you know them trying to market everything. But you got to understand that this is a business from day one with this show, with any television show or movie that's ever come out in the history of movie making or or television show making. It's a business and they want to get the most profit that they can out of, out of the, out of their content. So I just look at it like how, you know, sports is sort of handled as well. You know, sports, whenever a player is holding out with a contract, the reason why is because they want more money. And if the team's not willing to pay, well, then they'll go to another team. That, that's just sort of how the world works. And I don't think that's a bad thing at all. I think that's just, that's just the, the way the world has always, always worked. And that's why I believe in terms of marketing this show and making the show the most impactful, 
using the name The Walking Dead in the title, I think, makes the most sense. And so that's why for me with The Daryl Show, I hope that that the title is The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon. As of now, it just seems to be simply titled uh, Daryl Dixon Project, which I, I think is just the, 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 the code name for it right now. But I, I imagine that The Walking Dead Daryl Dixon is probably going to be the final title. I would be shocked if it was something else. Uh, and more specifically, because Norman Reedus is fighting for that title so much, like if they called it something else, I think it would just be it would be disappointing. It definitely would be disappointing. And as for the Rick and Michonne TV show, that's that's hard. I, I think the 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 title that they should use that makes the most sense is The Walking Dead Grimes. But it is sort of it, it's hard because of the big storyline that they have. And, and like, yeah, I don't know. Just what do you call it again? I still think with that show, like technically calling it The Walking Dead is probably the best title, right? Like, I think that that title, weirdly, just, it works so well. But, yeah, anyways, I'm going to leave it here. Definitely post all your thoughts down below. Hope you guys all enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.